Hey guys, Zuldin here, and welcome back to another episode of Pixar. Oh. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Squishy, you all right today, my friend? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're doing some decorating today, guys. I decided that I was going to take a little break since I got all those lamp stands. And uh-oh. This guy is really, really close. Um, <laughs> and I don't have any armor on. I'm just kind of enjoying the sun out here, you know? Dang it. We might have to take care of this dude, man. I tell you what. We're ready if he comes by. All right, 481. One time. Thunder. There we go. <laughs> That's kind of scary without armor, man. <laughs> it's okay, though. So I was playing around a little bit with, um, and there's now there's some meat. On my uh, my sidewalk, that that cannot do. We can't just have meat lying around on the beach. Um, I wanted to do a little beachfront, uh, not really a beach, but more like. Well, I needed to extend this area out a little bit because it was looking a little tight. I want to work on a table today, as well as get another waterfall added, as suggested by you guys. That way, we can hide up some of that unsightly, um, well, stone and flint and like. If it's if it's too mixed up like that, like it's it's really not cool. I might do a little bit of replacement for some of that uh, flint on this side because the waterfall is not going to be that big, but it's going to be similar to what that one looks like over there. Uh, then I'd like to work on a table for this little section, and we're going to start out by putting out some towels and a ladder. So uh, you guys had, had mentioned that I didn't have any stairs to get in the pool or a ladder or anything. So I'm going to add a little bit of a treatment. Again, I'm kind of scared to mess around with um, putting, well, taking the water away because it was such a big job and then putting the stairs in again. So I kind of have to experiment with it in creative before I go through with it. I haven't had a chance to do that yet, but I think I have a cool idea for a ladder. So let's, uh, I, I went ahead and gathered a lot of uh, stuff for carpets. So let's go ahead and try out some carpets here. I figured that we'd do a couple of beach towels, you know. Uh, so let's see. We're going to want them facing a couple different ways here. We'll do one right here. And we'll just do it square like this, all right? And then we'll do another one right here. We're going to go with the yellow, though, since it's a little bit closer. That one doesn't stand out too much, and we can do one right here as well. And this one will be a red one. That looks pretty good for a few beach towels, I think. All right, and as far as the way up, I think I'm just going to set a little bit of a ladder right here. So I played around with a few different features, and I think that this works the best. A roof, of all things, a roof. Uh, if you put, well, first I'm going to have to put a block down. So I'll tell you what, let's put, we can put a wall down instead. So let's put a wall down first. And on the side of that wall, we're just going to put a little ladder. It's kind of weird with that towel right there, huh? I might have to move that towel or whatever. I can also do the ladder a little bit further out, but it's it's fine. It should be okay. Let's go ahead and add the ladder. We'll take the wall away, and now we can do the roof and paint it. And when we paint it, it looks it looks a little bit <laughs> like there's no way I can't put the ladder in the pool right because it's gonna take away the water block. Um, so. This is probably the best the best deal right here. So you can still get in and out using the ladder. And it's not... <laughs> so there's no way to just put like little rails with the ladder sticking out. I've tried. I put rails on the side and I put a ladder out and the ladder just did not look good. The ladder would be great if I could just put it on in the water without messing up the, uh, the ladder button the water but it can't do it I'll make one for you guys just to show y'all what it does here and uh, well it probably won't let me right here no it won't it won't even let me oh it does oh wow actually it did mess up the water holy okay um well let's do that then 
Let's bring it down by one. I could have sworn it would mess up the water, but I guess not. All right. Well, that's kind of perfect. So if we take this away, let's just go ahead and pick it up and see what it looks like here. And I think that's probably the best bet. That's probably the best bet right there. We can actually do another ladder on the other side too. A little bit closer to this side. That'll probably be it. Wow. I really thought it would mess up the water, but I guess not. So let's just do it right here instead. Wrong one. Boom. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and take it away and take it away. Well, now we got a couple ladders in the pool. Not quite as dressy as the other method, but honestly, it's not. it doesn't stand out as much either, so that's okay with me. And again, I really want to play around with, um, with stairs and water to see how that works. It seemed to work okay with the jacuzzi, uh, but I'm not too sure. And now the towel looks a lot better without uh, that outstanding ladder deal, but that's the part of design. Okay, so... Kind of like I played around with that picnic table design inside that I showed y'all a couple of episodes ago. I think I'm going to try to do something uh, with this right here. So we don't want a traditional table because we want it three by three. Uh, so to do that, we're going to need to set down quite a few trap doors. Um, and that's going to be set next to blocks. So let's see. I got some Mediterranean walls here. Walls. I got some marble walls I could use too. It really doesn't matter. All right. So for, for me to do this, let's just go ahead and set down the middle one first. Okay. And then we're going to set down... Oh, wrong one. We're going to set down three more just like this. And actually, let's set down these first. We should have set down. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to redo that. So if I take if I take this away now, I should be able to just place this block. Yeah, this is how we're gonna have to do it because I have to set down three trap doors first. There we go. And actually, more so, I'm gonna have to do the same thing one more time. <laughs> There we go, because it's gotta be it's gotta come out like that. Alright, now we got it. So now we can pull these three. And then set trap doors. And then pull these three. And set trap doors. And then pull the braces. Alright, now will it let me place a wall right here? <laughs> if it doesn't, I'm gonna have to put it all back. I decided that I was gonna go with the western. So let's go ahead and put the western down. No, it doesn't. Unless this is just because... Well, that's okay. I can fix that. No problem. Uh, let's go ahead and put this down now. We want to do this shape right here. That shape right there will work. Okay. So, let's just do the marble wall here. And here, we can put the trap door... Hmm, it won't work right there, huh? That's interesting. How are we going to do that? How are we going to do that? Maybe, just maybe, we can still make it do what we want by opening it and then putting the western wall down. We can. Beautiful. All right. Whew. Whew. Saved. Now we just close. There we go. All right. I like it. I like it. It's a neat little table. Uh, okay. <laughs> it's kind of... The, 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 the tree is a little bit off center, but hey. <laughs> it's fine. So, um, I could take this away altogether and it would just show the middle... I mean, it, it won't be bad to take it away if we don't like it. I don't know if that's not better, guys. I kind of like that better. Unless... Yeah. I mean, honestly... 
I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Let's go ahead and open this up. And let's just try it with the square like that. I mean, the circles. So it covers it up all the way. That might be a better fit, actually. I think that might be a better fit. Yeah, I think that'll work better, to tell you the truth. I do like it better like that. Okay, let's put some chairs so it's not so noticeable, okay? Um, <laughs> so, uh, we need to do some Mediterranean chairs. Did I do those yet? Uh, no, I did not. All right, let's go grab some Mediterranean chairs in the house. Or make some, I should say. I picked up the die and stuff to do it. All right, Mediterranean. Okay, we're going to do three chairs around this one. Beautiful. And I also got some lampstands to put around to kind of do like a tiki torch thing, but I haven't decided how I'm going to do it yet. They might work pretty good on the western walls. We'll try it out uh, at the very least. Okay, so let's just put the chairs down now. We can do one chair like this. I don't know if I want to put them just evenly. I guess so. I guess if I didn't put them evenly, it would probably look kind of weird. Okay. Man, look at that. That's kind of fancy, y'all. I like that. <laughs> I like that a lot. We should probably do another chair to tell you the truth. That's okay. I mean, it does, it, it, it gives it the aesthetic. That's all I'm really worried about. Um, yeah, man, that's nice. That's really nice. <laughs> Squishy likes it too. All right. So here I still haven't decided exactly how I'm going to do it yet. I want to incorporate a fountain feature somewhere around here, guys. But I don't really have the type of room that I want. So I might seal this in. I just might seal it in. I was going to do like an underwater passage type thing, but I just don't see it being really, um, I mean, really efficient. Like, what would I use it for? You know, the water, I can't do water tames right now. I can't leave water tames out because when you get out of render distance, they still disappear from what I know. And... Uh, I mean, for a raft entrance, let's just face it. I really don't use a raft. <laughs> Nobody really uses rafts. Um, I mean, at the beginning, you do, you know. But uh, for for this specific outfit, I wouldn't have any. I'd like to experiment with some underwater docks and stuff. But is that a yellow drop? I have to go get it. I have to, I have to, I have to. I'm sorry, guys. This is like code red, man. Yellow drops are where it's at <laughs> yellow drops give me like unbelievable stuff when i see them i go and get them let's go see them we can take a little break from decorating anyway we've been doing so much adventuring lately i wanted to get back to decorating i like to mix it up a little bit you know back and forth back and forth back and forth i don't know how far out it's gonna be Oh, yeah, it's still very far. Oh, and it's in the middle of death. Look at what I'm going to be landing in here. This is going to be kind of weird. Okay, that's a tree ant. There's a lot of tree ants around here, man. A lot. And a lot of griffins. This is a very dangerous island. And there's one of those plants. Okay. First thing I'm going to do is probably lead this griffin away. Um, hmm. He didn't aggro. If I just land... He still doesn't aggro. Okay. Let's try it a little bit differently. Also, I need to buff my... I'm going to buff weight for this guy. He's kind of like my daily driver right now. Kind of like my daily drop. Yeah, get away from that yellow drop. Oh, no, don't go back down. Don't you do it. Okay. Looks good. Maybe. I 
think I will be alright if I grab it right here. Ouch! No! I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. <laughs> dang it, man! Dang it, dang it, dang it. Don't taunt him, Squishy! Alright. Quickly. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Not that uh, quickly, I said, store holler. You have to land quickly. Oh god, he's gonna be all on me again. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I, I don't. I don't know what I got, but I got it. All right. It looks like I got some steel ingots and stuff. That was pretty good. We might as well get the purple since it's on our way. Might as well get it. This one's gonna be much less dangerous to grab. Oh, a blueprint. Oh, I got it already. I got to uh, Dang, man. Danger zone. Whew. Okay. What did I get from that? I got... There was some steel stuff I saw. Normal iron bone boots. I don't think I had those before. There was steel ingots, I think. Uh, apprentice iron bone helm is 11.7. It's still not better than uh, my copper bone helm, my ascendant. Um... And we got a Magic Academy Ceiling Blueprint. I'm pretty sure we already had that. Yep, Mediterranean Wall Blueprint. There's some Magic Academy stuff that I really need, too. Oh, we got a an Industrial Smelter, which we didn't need. An, a second Industrial Smelter. Nope. Not using that much for it. Well, it was, <laughs> it was still worth it. Maybe somebody will... Magic Academy stuff is pretty rare, so maybe, maybe um, some other guys will need it. Uh, store holler might as well. No, I'll put him back. I'll put him back. All right. Well, we need to do the waterfall, so let's uh, let's actually take him out to do the waterfall because we might have a little bit of fighting to do. Kind of the same principle as I did last time, I think. Uh, I want the waterfall to come down like around right here, and I want it to cover up that unsightly stuff right there. So, if we just... This is going to be a little weird. But if we... Let me go, Star Uh If we took out this little part right here... It's going to kind of make it flow a little funky. But that's okay. Alright, we need to just make like a little lake up here. Very small. Actually, man... It has to be kind of right here instead. We could make it to where it's just coming out of the cliff face. But it would be a little bit weird. Hmm. Tell you what. Let's take off starting right here. Okay, and let's do just like this, and we'll kind of open it up. Just like this, I think. I think it'll be alright, just like that. Okay, so, we got some water blocks. And we'll place these like so. We want it to be full. I mean, we spawn these in anyway, so it's not like we have to craft them, you know? All right, so let's see how this is looking. This is gonna be relatively wide, I think. Okay, we're gonna need to put a few more like right there to go down. Right there to go down. I think it's going to go really wide here. Alright, let's... Can't forget my gargoyle either. <laughs> okay. If I... Put one down right here. That should trickle all the way down as well. I could do one right here that would trickle down. And then we are looking at... 
possibly one right here now that's gonna be a big old waterfall that might actually be too much we might need to make it concentrate a little bit more but right now I only have one more water block on me anyway let's see oh man <laughs> yeah, not even close not even close um, let's see I like it split like that but honestly we would have to put a lot more sand in the middle and we would have to make it go down too so let's see if I can place a water block from here there we go it just went straight down honestly that's gorgeous but it needs to we just need a few more water blocks and I think I'm gonna need to put a little bit more sand to hide it well. I don't know. I'm going to go spawn some more water blocks in, guys. I got to look up the code and stuff, and uh, then we'll come back and finish it off. So I went ahead and finished out the waterfall, and I think it looks good. I had to add a little bit of sand in the middle to kind of break it up. And I also put a little bit of dirt on the top left over there just so that it wouldn't be so wide because it was ridiculously wide. But I think it does the trick. Uh, next... I really want to do this. No, I didn't try it in creative. I just decided to go with it. Um, we're going to do Mediterranean stairs. And I don't, I don't, I didn't know if I wanted to go like that. Oh, not, no, for sure, not the, not the middle one like that. Uh, let's see, like this. I didn't know if I wanted to do that because it kind of it, it it it's kind of messed up, right? So let's just do it like this. It already kind of messes up, and let's see if I could put the water right on top. Hmm. No, it it appears that it goes red, which is weird because. That's so strange, man. If the water would be there already... Let's see. Let's see. If I put water on top... Can I put... That's gonna, that's gonna be weird. I don't know what that sound is either. No, I cannot put stairs right here. I can't. It just doesn't let me. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it, guys. I think it's going to look ridiculous. <laughs> I think it's going to look ridiculous. All right. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're just going to put that water back like that. And let's see if this messes up anything here. I really hope it doesn't. Everything looks good. Is it pushing down right here? Nope. Everything's fine. Phew. Well, we know that the uh, we know that stairs will not work in a pool. <laughs> Unfortunately, they will not. Um, but the waterfall and the table came out really, really good. I like this, and maybe you guys can suggest where to put a fountain. I'm probably gonna seal this in within the next couple of days. Somehow, I don't know if it's going to be fully and I'm going to need a little bit of water right here or what. And I might be able to do a fountain like right here somewhere. But I need to make sure that this is still connected to water, this waterfall, uh, or it won't really look good, you know. So anyway, guys, I think that's going to be it for today. I hope you all really enjoyed the episode. If you did, give us some dap on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Wow. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Ulgen signing off, and we'll see you next time.